yo what's up guys you are welcome back to across nigeria how are you guys doing today i hope you guys are doing wonderful as for me i'm doing just fine it's a beautiful monday afternoon uh, the 20th day of january 2020 my time here is 1 33 in the afternoon so wherever you are guys good morning good afternoon and good evening uh depends where you are listening from so i have an update um to share with you guys uh this monday afternoon as we just secondus peter obi abaribe protest against supreme court's judgment in abuja and um don't forget before i go back to give you this story to subscribe and i'm um, also click on the bell notification so you get instant update whenever we publish our stories what is happening across nigeria so the leaders and the supporters of the people democratic party have staged a protest across the street of abuja over the recent verdict of the supreme court that sat one of its uh, governors i'm talking about a maker hedioha uh, you can see from the footages there okay uh, you can see from the footages uh, the party's national chairman which is second uh, on friday during the party's emergency uh, national executive committee meeting stated that the aim of the protest was to impress it on nigerians that injustice has been done to the party the supreme court had on january 14 nullified the electoral victory of emeka hedioha uh, the PDP in most state 2019 governorship candidate. So the Apex Court had held that the candidate of uh, the APC, Hopu Zodima, was the duly elected governor of the state and ordered uh, that he be sworn in as the governor of the state. Okay, so some of the PDP leaders, as you can see at the protest, include the the PDP National Chairman, which is a Kondos, the 2019 Vice uh, President Candidate, Peter Obi, and the Senate Minority Leader, um, Enyinaya Abaribe. Okay, so um, just like which is a Kondos, uh, promised that uh, there's going to be a protest uh, so far. He has, um, you know, fulfilled that. You can see people, uh, the PDP protesting against the Supreme Court uh, verdict on state okay but the question now uh, is with all these protests with all these um, you know with all that is happening is, is, is there gonna be any difference I mean for the Supreme Court to reverse its judgment or maybe review that judgment what do you guys think um, is gonna happen don't you think um, I'm not here to criticize or support any political party but uh, just like uh, what a lot of people says here that it is a medicine after death okay and people are supposed okay uh, people are supposed to be jubilating on a Supreme Court judgment I'm not talking about uh, the judgment of uh, a maker head you have but uh, to look at it critically okay protesting against Supreme Court judgment instead of celebrating it shows that the country has gone as in I really don't understand that is my own personal opinion if you have your own opinion you can put it down in the comment section below I mean we Nigerians not only Nigerians we believe that the court is um, the last option for a common man irrespective of your gender or your class and so on okay the court um, is the last place for uh, a common man and uh, if people are protesting against the court ruling um, I really that's so pathetic for me I really don't see anything good about that okay so uh, like I said I'm not here to criticize I'm not supporting any political party um, I'm just an individual talking about uh, what's happening in Nigeria all right guys so um, uh, that is um, the update I have for you uh, that just like the PDP uh, promised to stage a protest concerning uh, the Supreme Court verdict uh, against Emeka Hedio and Hopu Zodima of the APC, okay, um, they have actually taken to the street 
of Abuja to carry out their protest. So don't forget to subscribe if this is your first time of watching any of our videos. I will see you guys in another video.